Welcome to an exclusive Galactic Figures reveal for the Vintage Collection. Now the character was pipeline revealed previously, but this gives you the exclusive first look at Cantina Band member Figurin Deanne. And will you look at this? How gorgeous does this figure look with a classic logo and a double racetrack going around the card? It looks absolutely beautiful. Now, Kenner never made Figure in the End during the original Vintage run in the 70s and 80s, and this is the first time that it'll be released in Kenner-style packaging. Now, Figure in the End has been released several times in the past, but it was always the same sculpt, which originated in 1997 as a Power of the Force 2 Star Wars fan club exclusive for the 20th anniversary of Star Wars. Dan Madsen, who ran the official Lucasfilm Star Wars fan club for George Lucas in the 80s and 90s, told me that the Cantina Band member was the most successful Star Wars action figure they had at the time. And you can listen to my interview with him on my podcast, Galactic Figure Talk, Episode 8. Now, after the release in 1997 for the 20th anniversary of Star Wars, Hasbro yet again released the figure for the 30th anniversary of Star Wars. It was basically a repack with added soft goods and differently painted musical instruments. Plus, the figures came packaged with a cool-looking tin. The very same figure yet again was made available for Star Wars Weekends in Disney World Florida, but the figures were individually carded and they came with a new bass which also played music. Now all those figures used the same sculpt as the original 1997 figure, and now in 2022, 25 years later, we finally get an updated version of this character which is super articulated and it's being released on a Kenner style card. The figure is not exclusive to a particular retailer. It'll cost $14.99 and it'll ship in early 2023. Pre-orders, however, go live on April 7th, 2022 at 1 p.m. Eastern Time at most major retailers. Check the link to Entertainment Earth in the description, please. Now, you might have noticed that the Vintage Collection figure in the end comes with three instruments. So where are the others? How will they be released and when? And I guess time will tell. Anyways, thanks for watching this exclusive first look on Galactic Figures. Hit the like, subscribe, and check out some of the other videos on the channel. Thank you, and I'll catch you next time.